YouTube, what's up? It's iPod Touch Help 19 here. And uh, before I start, I just want to say that uh, I've been really busy lately, so I haven't been able to post any new videos. But um, lucky for you guys, uh, I had the chance to post a video today. So today's video is going to be on how to control your computer with your iPod. <coughs> doesn't necessarily have to be with a uh, jailbroken iPod either so there's goods and bads actually there is no bad I don't think actually there kinda is uh, if you don't have a jailbroken iPod uh, you're gonna have to download an app for 30 bucks if you want to control your iPod which kinda sucks so uh, we're gonna get on to uh, the video um, you're gonna need this app right here it's called log me in <clears throat> uh, you can either get it off of at the App Store or install us. So um, install us for those who have a jailbroken iPod. And if you want to know how to j jailbroken iPod version 3.1.2, go check out one of my videos. So you're gonna want to uh, type in log me in, and then uh, it'll bring you to log me in ignition. See, as you see, it's 30 bucks. You're gonna want to download that if and buy it if you. Um, Want. So it uh, provides a one-click remote control for PCs or Macs. Uh, it's pretty cool. Um, so uh, it basically says it right here. Uh, you want to create your own account at logmein.com, which is on the computer right here. See, that's logmein.com. Simply, you just um, you try it. It's free. You click on it and you uh, sign up. And uh, all you do is you um, you. Uh, just basically sign up, so it's it's pretty easy. You want to use you want to get the log me in free. I know it doesn't really show a great on this camera from the, but you'll um, when you when you click on the site, I'll have the link in this in the description, and you can just uh, um, create an account and then download it onto your computer, and then it says uh, download the log me in software to your PC or Mac. Which, like I said, you after you create your account, you download it. You download the free trial, and then, um, and then uh, you choose a low-cost annual subscription or the free one, right? And then you download Log Me In Ignition from the App Store or install us. Then you log into your Apple device and access your computer. So it's pretty simple. Um, I'll uh, show. You, I'll reenact the kind of thing. Um, so once you finish downloading it to your PC. Uh, simply, you just uh, go on your log me in, and um, you uh, enter your username and password that you have created on the PC. So you just log in. And there it is. And then um, your computers. So uh, you kind of, when you install and down, when you install it, like after you finish downloading it, to your PC, you have to install it, and um, all it does is just it gives you um, it tells you to give you an, give a name for like your um, for the computer, so that when you have it on your app, uh, all you have to do is click on um, the name that you've given your computer um, from the software, and then you uh, click on it, right, and it starts connecting. It's as easy as that. I uh, um. There's not much more I can say, uh, and I'll, I'll show you that it's that I'm controlling my computer. So, um, let's see, we're logging in, right? Starting remote control. We'll look at the computer, and then um, so I'll have my iPod on the side. See, as you see, is uh, it's the same. We'll uh, and then I can scroll around with my mouse. Just like as I'm doing on my iPod, see. And then uh, I could X this out if I want. See, I'll have it on the corner. There we go. And then yeah, so you can basically control your own computer. It's pretty cool and uh, it's very simple. Now yeah, again, it's way easier. If you have a jailbroken iPod, um, but ba that's basically it. So uh, thank you for watching. Uh, I hope this helped, and I, I hope I uh, explained it good enough for um, for that 
that you guys could uh, now control your computers with your iPod. Um, let me know in the comments um, and uh, hope try and rate uh, uh, rate and subscribe please uh, and comment. I uh, need some help so um, with the comments it could uh, help me out and make my videos better. Thank you.